The film Twelve Years a Slave, directed by Stephen McQueen, tells the story happened in nineteenth century. A free black man named Solomon Northup was abducted by two white men, and he was forced to change his own name into、um, Platt and、uh, be a slave for twelve years. He experienced a lot of difficulties, and finally he was rescued by proving his initial identity, thanks to a Canadian woodworker. Race discrimination has been one of the biggest worldwide problem since hundreds years ago. This discrimination was the main catalyzer of. Slave system. This film reveals the inhumanity of slave system. The very bad slave owner, Abs, existed in a speech of Holy Bible to his slaves for the first time. He especially picked a piece from Luke, which was, and that servant, which knew his lord's will. And、uh, prepared not himself, neither did according to his will, shall be beaten with many stripes. He thought this piece implies that the nigger that don't obey his lord, that is his master, shall be beaten with many stripes. And he just wanted to use this piece to claim that. Since the Bible tells the slaves to ob- obey the demand of their master,、uh, otherwise master could punish them. This treatment of was、uh, allowed by Bible and was very reasonable and logical. His violence was mainly revealed on his attitude towards Patsy. Patsy worked very hard. He could pick five pounds cotton every day, which was way more than the amount each male slave could pick every day. And he could use leaves to make dolls. But Abs appreciated her with a morbid mentality. He ignored his wife's envy and praised Patsy. He always raped Patsy. As soon as he heard that Patsy had interaction with others, he would lash her. In Abs' pers- in Abs' perspective, Patsy was a perfect tool, both for work and satisfying his own desire. Abs' all、uh, Abs' role in this film is to represent the actions of slave owners at that time and em- em- emphasize the. Inhumanity of slave system, but slave was hard to be. But slave system was hard to be eliminated. Solomon initially was sold to Mr. Ford, who was a small estate owner and a prize as well. Unlike the Abs, he really followed the right way the Bible guided. He treated well to Solomon. He gave Solomon a violin for him to play, and even helped him when Solomon was unfairly treated by other overseers. Mr. Ford, as a kind slave owner, reflects the conscience of a part of white at that time. However, finally, he still could not help Solomon after Solomon told his initial identity. This shows. Slave system was not a problem that could be solved by any individuals. It was a social pro- problem. We should realize that although Mr. Ford was extremely kind, he still could not get rid of identity of slave owner. Meanwhile, although Epps was very atrocious, he still could kill some white workers. Working with slaves, the slave system made people alienate. Let kind people have to do bad things 
and let bad people be worse. How evil self-centeredness! Thank you.